going on everybody? This is Dayton from Killinois Kennels again. We just got out here to Chicago to our hotel room and uh, we come out here for this BRC Nationals going on tomorrow. It's gonna be a real good event, man. There's gonna be a lot of people out there, a lot of dogs. Really looking forward to this. Um, this is like the Super Bowl of dog shows. One of the biggest dog shows of the year. It's here in the heart of the Midwest in Chicago and it's about to go down. So make sure you guys stay tuned. It's gonna be a real good vlog. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. We really, really appreciate it. Also go back and check out some of our other videos. We got a lot of real nice American Bully content on this channel. But yeah, again, we're out here for the BRC Nationals. It's gonna be a real good time, man. Really looking forward to it, real excited. And uh, we hope you guys like this video. What's up, Kellinoy Kennel? Little Kellinoy Kennels is. Come on, man. Give give the give the camera something, man. Dude, the kids. There's kids that watch this channel. They are waiting for you guys to get on here. You know what I mean? You guys want to act shy and shit and all that. Can I say something? Can you say something? Where are we going tomorrow? Where are we going tomorrow? Chicago. We're in Chicago. Where are we going tomorrow? Dog show? All right. You guys are lame. This hotel was super dope, man. It reminded me of the Lumiere Hotel in St. Louis that we always go to. But this vlog is about a year old. You know, this is one of the videos we got in the vault. We don't want to keep on posting show vlog after show vlog after show vlog and eventually run out. So, you know, we're trying to spread these out. So that's why we're posting this one so late. But it's still going to be a real good video. Got the young gunners out here with me today. I'm here with the Young Guns of Killinois, man. I'm wondering how many kids actually watch this channel. If you are a kid and you watch this channel, how many of you guys want to see Dayton and Blaze more active on the vlogs and stuff? If you do, leave it in the comment section and let us know. Our room was super dope too, man. Big shout out to Kev and Jackie for booking us a real nice room out here. And, uh, you know, like I said, this is one of our older videos, so the footage ain't going to be quite as good. You know, just the all overall layout ain't going to be quite as be good as they are now. You know, we got way better equipment now. We know how to do these videos a little bit better, but it's still going to make out for a real good vlog. Like we do in all of our other show vlogs on the channel, we start off with a little walk around, let you guys get a real good look at the venue, you know, all the booths, all the, you know, people selling stuff, all that good stuff, you know, we do a little walk around, let you guys get a real good look at everything. You know, this day, man, was a really, really messed up day. I was supposed to judge the first show. We pulled in the night before, you know, checked into our room, went got the kids something to eat and stuff came back chilled out at the room woke up the next day went to head to the show got in our car for some wild reason the car wouldn't start man so we're sitting there freaking out you know we're three and a half four hours away from the house you know i'm trying to figure out how i can hurry up and get a ride up to the show you know we were calling up the show hosts and stuff like that they were too busy they couldn't come get us you know, so we had to call an Uber, took an Uber up there, man. And it was just a long, crazy day, man. I was super worried about getting our car fixed and what was going to happen. You know, we need, we, you know, we are three and a half hours away from the house, man. So, you know, our car breaking down in Chicago really wasn't a good thing for us. You know, we didn't have no idea what was going on with it. You know, we tried to start it, tried to jump it, all types of crazy stuff, man. So this day was a real stressed out day for me. You know, it would have been cool if I would have been able to judge the first show and get back, you know, and try to get my car fixed. But they had already started the first show, and you know, which the show must go on. You know what I mean? But 
it just man the whole day i was stressed out had a real you know i didn't have a real real good time man i was you know too worried about this car situation but i ended up manning up and you know did my best to try to make this the best vlog we possibly could which it is a really good vlog so make sure you guys stay tuned man you know we got a real good fun show coming up you know we got the best in show got a lot of real nice footage for you guys it's gonna be a little bit different show vlog than what you guys are used to but it's still gonna be a real good vlog i want to send a big shout out to everybody that came up and tried helping us with our car several people you know that's one thing about the bully community man if something's wrong they all come together you know a lot of people at this show helped us out with our car that day man you know my homie hector from lay low kennels you know gave my girl a ride up to the hotel once we got there tried to figure out some things with the car they couldn't figure it out you know the whole time i'm sitting here you know letting everybody know what's going on and why i'm not judging the first show and all that and you know all the people man all that's you know the bully community is one big family man and all these guys came together tried helping me out tried seeing what was up with the car we couldn't figure anything out but again big shout out to all you guys that came out and tried helping us man so you know just had to suck it up man and finish out this job and you know it was still a good real good event man and you know i had fun but if anybody was wondering why I had a, you know, crappy look on my face is because I was having a really rough day there, man. Big shout out to Kev Green and all the kennels that sponsored the trophies for this show, man. They went super hard for the trophies for this event. I can't wait to see the awards for this national show coming up this weekend. For those of you that don't know, this Saturday, October 5th in Murfreesboro, Tennessee, we got the 2019 brc global nationals and i'll be judging that event as well you know we're going to be out there doing a killinois kennel show vlog so if you guys want to come out get in on the vlog you know rep your kennel or if you guys just want to come out and check out the show make sure you guys do so it's going to be a real good event Here is the 2018 BRC Global Nationals Champion Class for the American Bullies. There's a bunch of real nice show quality American Bullies in the ring this day. This is the best in show class for show one. How we do our nationals at the BRC Global is a little bit different than most registries. We have two shows with two different judges. The first judge will pick his best in show class. Those dogs will move on to the finale and they won't be able to be shown in the second show. So then the judge judging the second show, he will pick a best in show class where a third judge comes in and he goes over both best in show classes, picks his best in show, and will pick the overall winner for the nationals. So like I said, not a whole lot of registries do it like this. This is something that we've been doing over here, man. And this is something that I think it makes our nationals stand out a little bit more from others, man. So I think it's cool. You know, it gives three judges to overlook the dogs and determine the overall winner. And don't forget, this Saturday, this same exact show is going to be going down in Murfreesboro, Tennessee. All the information is on this banner. You can pause it and get it there. You can give me a call and we'll help you get to that show. This right here was a real cool fun show hosted by F.W. Spielberg. They'll have the dogs come out to the ring and the dog that gets the bigger reaction from the crowd moves on until there's no dogs left. This is stacked to the finish. Up 
for the American boy? Yeah. Get him. Get him. Bring your tail to $20 right now. You can get it. Quick. All right. Oh, you want to wait? Okay. I, like I, 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 I love the energy, but you want to wait until we're done? No, I'm just kidding. All right, on the right. Make some noise for Sasha. Woo! On the left, make some noise for Kimbo. Woo! All right, help me out again, guys. The loudest for the one that you want. On the right, Sasha. Woo! On the left, Kimbo. This is straight up bull crap.
wasn't able to get a ton of footage of my show you know but i did get a little bit of footage of each breed and right now you're looking at the english bulldogs
Now you're looking at the exotic bullies class. We wasn't able to get too much footage of my show. Like I said earlier, we had some issues with our car. You know, my girl got another ride back to the hotel trying to, you know, get things figured out with the car. And, you know, but, you know, I did get a little bit of the English Bulldog class, a little bit of the exotic class. And right now you're looking at the American Bullies. This right here is your final best in show class. The judge just asked him to take one more lap around the ring. You got the American Pitbull Terrier in the front. You got the French Bulldog behind the American Pitbull Terrier. You got the English Bulldog. And you got the American Bully. First, the judge is gonna go ahead and pick the reserve. Reserve is like second place for the best in show. And then after this, he will be picking the best in show winner for the 2018 BRC Global Nationals. The American Pitbull Terrier takes the reserve. Now the judge will be picking the dog that wins the whole 2018 BRC Nationals. This next dog he picks will actually win the whole show. By this time of the show, you know, things were starting to die down. The only people that really still left was the people that's dogs was still in the running for the best in show. You know, most of the people that weren't in the show anymore was already breaking down their kennels and getting up out of there. It was a real, real long day. But one thing I do want to mention is, is the BRC Global has grown a bunch in the past year. This next show coming up this weekend is going to be huge. Nationals winner 2018. Make some noise one more time. We got the Frenchies, the English, and the American Bullies. All right, there we go, Bowser. Two years in a row. Two years in a row. Congratulations. Hey, we think something. Well, that's it for our video of the 2018 BRC Global Nationals. The American Bully took that event and you know, like I said, we were having some car issues. My girl left, went to go figure it out. After the show, we went back to the hotel, tried messing with the car for a little bit. And then out of nowhere, the car just started up right on its own. So it was a little problem with the starter, but I was ending up tripping and stressing out that whole day for nothing. But again, this Saturday, October 5th, in Murfreesboro, Tennessee, we got the 2019 BRC Global Nationals. I'll be judging this event. I judged the first show. Anthony Pope judges the second. And Ron Ramos picks the final decision to who wins the 2019 BRC Global Nationals. If anybody needs any help getting to this event, you just pause it right here. The address is right on this banner. Or you give me a call at 217 280 
0151 and I'll give you all the information you need to get to this show. We will be doing a Killinois Kennel show vlog on this event. So for anybody who wants to come out, get in on the show vlog. You know, you can get on there, rep your kennel, show off your dogs, all that good stuff. Make sure you come up and introduce yourself. Even if you don't want to get on the vlog, you know, make sure you come up and introduce yourself. It's real good meeting you guys at these events. And I want to send a huge shout out to all of our subscribers and supporters. Everybody that shows love on the videos, hits that like button tells their friends about our channel shares our videos all that good stuff we're coming up on 20,000 subscribers and we couldn't have got there without your guys's help our goal is 25k before the new year starts so keep up all that support and don't forget we're going to be having some real nice show quality american bullies becoming available here really soon we have the frisco and elsa pups the stacks and prada pups the Stacks and Nina Pups, and the White Folks and Chi Chi Pups all will be coming available here really soon. So make sure you guys stay tuned to this channel. Make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. And make sure you guys stay tuned. We got a lot of real nice stuff coming up to the channel. And thanks for watching. We really, really appreciate it.